hey guys welcome to my channel hope you're doing well so aquarius this video will be for you if you have any aquarius placements or if you're dealing with an aquarius please take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest for somebody else i'm going to see what your current situation is maybe some advice at the end um first and foremost let's see what your angels would like you to know right now okay guys so first message for aquarius 807 your expression of excitement and joy is waving is weaving wonder and miracles into your everyday life Embrace them wholeheartedly. Okay, that's always good. As you manifest great things in that energy. Energy. So 309, your higher self is guiding you at this time. Dive deep within and be open to new directions. Okay, so 839, you are uniting with the divine feminine and are being guided to open up your heart and mind to divine intervention. That's funny because I, um, I um, actually mentioned that in one of the readings, there was an intervention. It might have been Tauruses. So if you guys have Taurus in your chart or dealing with one. Um, actually, it might have been Gemini. It might be, I think it was Gemini. I beg your pardon. It was Gemini. All right, guys. Let's see. What's your current situation? I'll use this deck today for you guys. So please tell me about Aquarius. What's currently going on with Aquariuses? Please, the collective Aqu Aquariuses. What is currently going on with the collective of Aquariuses? I just heard stand by me. Okay, someone standing by your side, somebody supporting you. Okay, you could be supporting them. Could be you could have a very good support system, or or some of you guys um, may need to realize and recognize there's um, there are people out there that will support you. Okay, so let's see. Ten of Pentacles. Okay, Aquarius. Okay. Like that a lot. So you guys are definitely dealing with a Taurus or so had Taurus in your chart. Now, there could be a lot of stability coming your way. Money, okay. Some of you guys are building a legacy as well. Some of you guys are working towards your dreams, okay. A lot of hard work, okay. You don't, don't just get the Ten of Pentacles sleeping all day and stuff like that, okay. Or, or not going out. So some of you guys, this could be... You doing that, getting out more, working harder than normal, or seeing all your hard work paying off, okay? The devil. Ooh, so this is quite an obsession for you right now. Some of you guys, it could be a relationship that's an obsession. It could be your work that's an obsession, okay? There's some kind of obsessive energy. The devil also, also oh, okay, for some of you, um, it could be a thing where um they could be say for example you get a lot of money and then you're like do you know what let me spend a thousand pounds on this bag let me let me have a two thousand pound holiday so some of you guys are spending um much more than you would but i'm also getting this energy of like needing to kind of um balance things out okay somebody could have addictions as well someone's addictions could be costing them a lot of money okay so take what resonates, leave the rest. Doesn't have to be necessarily you directly. It could be somebody around you that's affecting you, okay? All right, so tell me more, please. Hierophant. So we've got Capricorn and we've got, um, and we've got Taurus here, okay, twice. So, yeah, it's definitely something to do with a relationship and lessons. Okay, thank you, spirit. The co These combinations, this is crazy, guys. This is why I love tarot, okay? The combination of these cards here, um, some of you guys, this is in a, a very intense connection, okay, that some of you guys are dealing with, um, or it, I could be predicting something as well. You may come back in a week and be like, well, I met somebody a few days ago and we're just like, we're like, we're like um, that, yeah, very, very um, tight knit, I'm getting. What am I getting? There's something about this relationship that is this connection. Let's just say it's connection, okay, this connection that maybe bring out an obsessive side of you maybe a toxic side maybe some of you guys are looking into that but i'm getting serious lessons being learned here i'm also getting some of you guys i'm getting so many messages for you today i'm getting so many messages for you aquarius i'm also getting some of you guys um working really hard to pay off your your um something to do with student student loans okay any kind of debt that you have going on there but i do see you yeah um I do see that working out for you. Seven of Cups. Tell me more, please. The Ace of Wands. 
this is like which direction do i okay so some of you guys have a lot on your plate right now that's why this energy is coming out that's why i feel like boom 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 like this message that message that. so there's a lot coming out but why do i feel like this something's opening the door for you to uh, uh, receive things okay something's happening in your life where something new is going to happen it could be um something that you've built and it's actually happening now it's coming to you now it could be a relationship where it allows you to have a different kind of lifestyle okay seven of swords here tell me more please ace of pentacles there's some kind of start here this is really crazy um ace of wands the seven of swords and ace of pentacles there's there's this passionate start here but it feels wrong but i see some how can i put trying to think of an example to give you so it could be a relationship to you some of you guys okay some of you guys could feel like this there's somebody here that's a bit deceptive as well let's just put it like that okay if i get more cards nine of swords you guys are being offered something okay or you will be offered something but I'm seeing you kind of like, I could have this, but I'm going to feel like this. I could have this, but this can go wrong. So this, well, this could be, um, say, for example, you know, oh, you get a job 50 miles away, 100 miles away, which will take you away from your partner, maybe your family, something like that. And you're worried about if things can, mean, something about something being maintained here. So if you guys are wondering if you should take an offer as well, if you should accept an offer, whether it's a job or a relationship. So if you guys are something sexual as well, could be a casual thing. Okay, six of wands. Some of you guys are going to be so successful. Are you joking me? The ten of pentacles and the six of wands. Okay. So some of you guys are coming into uh, more money. Okay, definitely more money is coming up here. But I'm also you getting more attention here. Okay, and being like, you know, getting a lot of um, praise for what you do okay you could be in the spotlight for some of you guys four of wands nine of wands and six of swords some of you guys can be dealing with a fire sign aries leo sagittarius so why do i feel like there's there's a this person here there's this person here who's given you a lot of attention and some of you guys may have i'm not sure if this is somebody that you've been dealing with for a while or is it if, if it's a fairly new co uh, connection but what am I getting that some of you guys are wary of? I'm not sure of what you've gone through and you're thinking, I don't want to go through that again. I don't want to be open up. That's why I'm getting this. There's an offer being made to you. And some of you guys are thinking about the negative things of, yeah. But maybe you know something about this person, which is understandable. That's fine. But some of you guys are thinking about the negative side of relationships or this move or this opportunity. Tell me more, please. King of Cups. The, I look. I just made that face here because the Ace of Wands and the King of Cups. Somebody, so, some of you guys may. <sighs> wow. Wow. Some of you guys don't even realize this, but you've, without sounding too overly, it's not about sounding overly spiritual, but it sounds a bit far fetched. But I'm gonna say it. When I saw that combination, I literally felt like you brought me back to life. You've given me life again. Like. I'm not saying that you literally give them, brought somebody back to life, but somebody could have been really down and your love, the passion that you have has really ignited um, love within somebody. It's like you've, King of Pentacles, Wheel of Fortune. Some of you guys have made somebody fall for you, hardcore, but I am getting, mm, King of Pentacles and Seven of Swords, somebody here, Tell me about this Seven of Swords. This The combination is weird. Somebody could be involved here. So I'm not sure if you're involved or your person's involved, but it's the way the cards are coming out, it's showing me that it's weird because the King of Pentacles is there, Seven of Swords. We've got the Ten of Cups and None of Swords. So unless you're having doubts about your connection, some of you guys are dealing with somebody and worried if they're, um, how they feel about somebody else or how if it's you it, <clears throat> if you're dealing with somebody some uh, two people or three people you know but it's showing that it shouldn't come out like that I mean it's come out like that but it, there could be more than two people involved here yeah T the tower yeah 
this is why some of you guys are wondering about this opportunity, about this um, new start, this new relationship, <clears throat> or taking a new job or new path. Hmm. Okay, tell me more, please. The Ace of Cups. There we go. There's that relationship again with the Queen of Cups. Some of you guys have fallen really hard for this person, the Empress. Some of you guys, if you don't want children, you know what to do. Okay, some of you guys could have children with this person. Okay, there could have been some, somebody could have just, yeah. Mm. Aquarius, I don't know if this is you, them. I don't know if this is an outside energy. Okay, but I'm going to have to say it, yeah. It's, it's really quite clear to me. So there's more that, there's more than two people here, okay? But I'm also getting like somebody could be married, somebody could be pregnant, somebody could have just had a baby. The Ace of Cups as well is also giving birth. Queen of Cups and the Empress. Tell me more, please. The Queen of Wands. There's there's quite a few people here coming up in this reading. So the Temperance. Someone's falling hard and they it's like they don't care about what what is outside. The, okay. The lovers, yeah, some of you guys, this is your, some of you guys feel like this is your soulmate, but why is this, why is it this sneaky energy around it, this anxiety around this and the, the devil and all that, and then thinking the moon, you're not sure how somebody truly feels, knight of pentacles, some of you guys are trying to get this person to open up or tell you where you stand or where, or they're waiting for you to tell you, um, waiting for you to tell them where they stand. It's quite, there's it's a lot going on in this reading. And when that normally happens, it means that there's a lot some, going on in somebody's life. So I'm not sure if this has happened over years, over months. Yeah, definitely not weeks, because that's just, you know, that's, that, that's too much. If that happens, let me just say this now. If all this has happened over a few weeks, run for the hills, okay? Run, run for the hills. So some of you guys, this could be a 10 year relationship. Some of you guys a two-year relationship, six months maybe. Maybe some of you guys have found things out. The Hermit, the, two, the Three of Wands, the King of Wands, and the Six of Pentacles. Somebody's ghosted somebody. Someone's like turned their back on somebody here. Um... But they're waiting. It's really weird. Tell me more. Nine of Cups. Somebody's, uh, I'll be real with you, Aquarius. Somebody's doing something um, uh, to, not so much to feed their ego, but this is not somebody's higher self. I'm going to be real. Okay. This feels like somebody's kind of given into temptation here. Tell me about that devil, please. Three, eight of Cups. Yeah, somebody's walked away from a relationship or a marriage. Ten of Pentacles, the Devil, the Hierophant, and the Eight of Cups. Somebody's walked away from a marriage, okay? The Chariot. Yeah, someone's, like, fully, like, left it. Hanged man. They left somebody hanging. The King of Swords. They've gone cold on somebody or cold on you, okay? I'm getting, like, some messages. There could be a child here involved as well, Okay? So the messages will pick up, but I feel like it will, will somebody's kind of stand offish or, or something will become blocked. There's a hell of a lot of things going on in this reading. Um, so the truth will be known soon, okay? Ace of Swords, the Emperor, someone's could be an Aries, somebody's taking control of this situation. Something's a burden here, and it feels like it because this is a lot going on in one reading, okay? This is like when that happens because sometimes it's very straightforward and it's it, in a way it's straightforward but there's a lot of different things going on so it feels a bit chaotic right now i'm not sure if this is what you're going through with your person if they put you through this or either way okay but i'll be real it feels like there's more than two people in this reading okay so i'm not sure if there's some kind of infi infidelity or um you know the cheater card has come up here but I'm also getting a lot of cards to do with marriage, Ten of Pentacles, Four of Wands, the Hierophant, but the devil is around it, and the Nine of Wands and Six of Swords says, so making me feel like somebody is committed or was committed, and they're, they're yeah. 
not the reading I kind of want to give you today, guys, but it is what it is, okay? I have to give the message. Um, I'm going to leave it there. <sighs> oh, let me give some advice. Hold on. Let me give some advice for you guys. Let me give some advice. This is a reading that definitely um, calls for advice. So what advice do you have, please? Wow, that's deep. Wow. Woo! Aquarius, listen to this. Embrace. Through each other, you find the missing pieces. Something that you've been looking for. Something that maybe consciously, maybe subconsciously, okay? Some of you guys have been looking for something, yeah? Well, whether you know it or not, okay? But I feel like whoever you're dealing with, there's something within them that's within you. And it's like, you listen to this, that you need to kind of address Listen to this. Don't make decisions based on guilt or what you think you should do. For it is only being true to yourself. For it is only in being true to yourself that you can be true to others. That's so funny. I actually said that yesterday to somebody. Um, reflection. Okay. See what I was saying about um, through each other. You find the miss missing pieces, guys. Reflection here. Give each other some space at the moment. Trust and have faith that all will work out for the best, whether it's with that person or not. But I feel like some of you guys will really understand. Why well, do I feel like this is deeper than just what's going on? There's something much bigger happening, but I feel like it's a time for reflection and maybe to see what you want, what you don't want. Is this obviously this feels like a very um, difficult time for you guys? Okay, um, it feels quite intense. So. Somebody's got to take control of the situation here. And um, this feels like a lot, I'll be honest, I'll be honest, it feels like a lot of, it's about the ego. Oh, this feels good. Oh, I want this. Oh, I have to have this. Oh, this is, you know, this is mine, mine. But this doesn't feel like it's benefit. It's not going to benefit somebody. Well, I don't feel like somebody's going to be very hurt here. Yeah, Nine of Swords, Ten of Cups and the Tower. Someone's going to be very hurt here. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to leave it there, all right, guys. It's not the kind of reading I like, but you know, someone's going through that. I'll leave it there. Please like, share, subscribe if you'd like a personal reading. All the information's in the description. Have an amazing weekend, and I'll see you in the next reading. Bye, guys.